There is no school today in Santa Fe, Texas, where people are mourning the shooting deaths of 10 people at the local high school. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Huli Sertis. Dozens of people attended a candlelight vigil last night for the victims, and more tributes are planned for today. Omar Villafranca has the latest from Santa Fe, southeast of Houston. Across Texas this morning, people paused to honor the lives lost in Friday's school shooting. The governor called for a statewide moment of silence for the 10 victims killed and 13 injured in Friday's massacre. There are no words. Over the weekend, there were more tributes at church services and vigils. Hundreds of worshipers attended this mosque to remember Pakistani exchange student Sabika Sheikh, who aspired to work in civil service. Jolene Cogburn was her U.S. host mother. She wanted to be a businesswoman and she said she wanted to impact the world. On Saturday night, hundreds of fans packed the stands at Santa Fe's playoff baseball game. Two players even suited up after being shot during the massacre a day earlier. Police say 17-year-old suspect Demetrius Pogorchis wore a trench coat and carried a Remington 870 shotgun and a 38 caliber pistol during the attack. Lieutenant Governor Dan Patrick suggested Sunday that guns were not the issue. The best way to take that shooter down is with a gun. Pogorci surrendered to police a half hour after they arrived to confront him. He immediately waived his Miranda rights and is now in solitary confinement. Nicholas Pale and Robert Barfield represent Pogorci's. They say their client might not have been in the right state of mind, even though his social media post before the shooting showed an affinity for weapons and contained violent messages. This is a young kid who's uh, at this point very confused and I think still in some shock. Houston Texans star J.J. Watt has offered to pay for the funerals for all of the victims. And the suspect does face two felony charges, capital murder and aggravated assault of a peace officer.